Hey guys! Oh! <laughs> again I'm going back to school yay I'm just kidding I love school anybody that knows me knows that like I am a nerd to the extreme I love school but it can be a little stressful sometimes because when I go to school I have to go 2,000 miles across the country to Boston and so that requires me packing up pretty much my entire life into two checked bags a carry-on and a backpack so, it's kind of a stressful time to like organize all that stuff. So what I'm going to try to do is get a head start, go through all of my clothes and decide what I really need, what I really want to bring with me, and what I don't. So that's going to be this video today. I'm going to put them into three different categories. I'm going to put them into absolutes, I need this, this is great, mediocre, I feel good in it, but I might not need it, and then I should definitely leave this at home. Um, notice I don't have like a get rid of pile because I've already gone through my clothes and decided like what I really want to like get rid of. Um, and I did that last year as well, but I all I have this feeling that like some clothes I connect with sometimes and I don't connect with them other times, but if I leave them at home then that gives me an opportunity to basically go like go shopping a second time when I get home at the end of the year. Um, and when I've changed a little bit, you know, I've changed as a person, I like look at my clothes and I'm like, hey, I like that shirt again. That happened with this dress that I absolutely love. Um, and so it's just kind of nice. So I'm not, I'm not, I'm not eager to get rid of anything yet. Um, and I know that that might not be like the best or most sustainable thing to do, but that's just what, that's where I'm at. So, so basically I'm going to divide them up into those three categories and then lay them out on the bed. And the ones that are definitely going to stay home, I'm probably not going to try on. I'm just going to put them to the side. The ones that I'm not sure of, I'm going to try on. And the ones that I'm definitely taking, I'm just going to definitely take. Like there's nothing that's going to stop me. That's what I'm going to do. And if I don't love it, I don't like, I'm, I'm going to need this and I'm going to leave it. I'm not really counting anything that's in my dirty clothes hamper because if it's in my dirty clothes hamper that means I've worn it in the past like week and that means that I probably love it. Um, so I'm probably going to take it. So that doesn't really count but yeah everything else is like up for grabs slash whatever. Okay so yeah I'm definitely I'm trying a lot more now to put more thought into what I wear and how I dress and when I wear my makeup because I don't know if any of you know, I'm obsessed with Queer Eye. I said that with crazy eyes, but I'm obsessed with Queer Eye. I love that show. It's amazing. And I know it's, it's, I mean, it's for everybody. Like, they've done, like, women, they've done transgender people, they've done men, they've done gay men, they've done straight men. Like, it's great. Like, they, it's so inclusive, and I think it's amazing. Um, and a lot of the stuff they talk about is just, like, really feeling yourself. Like, being confident in yourself and a lot a lot of confidence for me comes from what how I present myself to the world and so if I look nice and I have my makeup done my hair done I look really good I feel so good and it's just something that like as humans like it's just a part of like who we are and like I also have taken off my makeup at night before and been like damn I'm beautiful I love my face I think I'm great and it's just a really good feeling because for a long time I was not at a place like that I was not secure with myself so now that I'm at that place it feels really good um, to just embrace it and it's not necessarily being vain it's not being like bragging or anything like that it's just embracing who you are and loving who you are and that's what I'm learning a lot anyways so <laughs> I really want to like have better style and I really want to like showcase that more and like go to class looking good and not in my sweatpants all the time. So there will definitely be some days where I wear my sweatpants to class, faux show, but oh god that was ugly for sure, but not all the time, not like you know the past two years have been. So I understand it's going to take a few more day like minutes out of my daily routine to get ready and to look nice, but overall I think it's going to be worth it and I think it's definitely going to help my mental health and just like staying happy and staying positive while I'm away at school. So that's my two cents. So there's going to be a lot of clothes on this bed and it's going to be really fun and probably take a while. So stay tuned. It's going to be fun. Bye. Yeah, I go when they want to get it go. My all go to see the greatest ever talk go. It's night time and the night. Okay, I know the quality of the video has changed because I'm not using my laptop instead of my phone. But, hi! But anyways, um, I have a lot of clothes. This is just from my closet. 
I still have stuff hanging. And I still have stuff in bags. So this is really necessary. Because <laughs> I can't take all this with me to Boston. Anyways, um, ugh, stay tuned. So basically I'm going to go through all of my hanging clothes first and then tackle all my folded clothes. So yeah, that's going to take a while. I'm just going to start. Let's just start. and the like definitely yes pile and a significant amount in the other piles I think it's like kind of half and half actually of um, things I absolutely need and things like I might want so yeah now we're gonna do folded clothes and I guess it's kind of good that all of the clothes that are in my closet like I either need or like really want um, but it makes it really tough to think of things to leave. This pair of shorts was literally the only thing that I was like, I'll leave this at home. I'm filming on two different devices basically, so lighting change is different, voice change is different, and also the sun went down, so like, you know. But it can still be a good video if the lighting changes in the middle of it, so we're gonna, you know, keep the ball rolling. But I wish you could see what I what setup I have right now. Anyways, it's hilarious. I'm gonna do the, this is my guitar. I'm gonna do the folded clothes now. So, not as much as I thought. I was worried there's gonna be even more. But yeah, so here goes round two. That's four. Round two, round two, round two, round two, round dope. That's the definitely pile. I've got a lot of like stylish stuff, but I've also got um, basically essentials like my bell bottom jeans that I just got. I need those. I got mom jeans, um, and I have a pair of black ripped jeans that are really stylish that I really like. So those are stuff that like I can make outfits out of, right? And they're, like they're pretty versatile. Um, I can wear my mom jeans anywhere, but you know, in that pile, I have like pairs of skinny jeans that I might not necessarily need. Um, in that pile, I have a pair of leggings, black leggings that I can use to work out in, black leggings that I can basically be wearing with anything. I have like five workout shirts. I feel like that's enough because I'll hopefully be working out at least three times a week and doing my laundry pretty regularly. So I don't think I'm going to run out of like workout clothes. Um, I definitely have a lot of workout leggings. I guess I don't need all of those. So that's why I put some in there. And there's also like ones with holes in them, which I guess I should get rid of, but it's kind of hard because I love them. Um, so yeah, now it's time to go through all of the other stuff. I'm still not sure which ones exactly I want to take with me, but I know I want to take my jumpsuit with me, and then the green dress that I have because I think that it would be really cute. Basically, that's it. I'm going to go through these, um, this giant pile behind me, and we're going to see how that goes. I'm probably going to try on a lot of clothes, so wish me luck. It's like I'm going shopping. It's fine. Mm -hmm. 